So to celebrate bonfire night, we're going to make our own fireworks. So in your pack, you should have a bit of card like that that's black on one side and a, a colour on the other. And you should have a little yellow scratchy stick that we're going to use to scratch out our pattern. And then you should also have a long tube of any colour and then also a couple of little bits that we're going to use to put it together at the end. So just put those to one side. So what you need first is your bit of scratch art, black side up and your scratchy pen. Now you can draw anything you like on here. You can do uh, zigzags, so nice big zigzags, but whatever you do, make it nice and chunky so that all of those colours come through really nicely. So you could do zigzags or you could do flowers if you want to. You can do absolutely anything you like. And scratch those out. Um, what else could you do? You could do um, hearts if you wanted to. Absolutely anything that you want to do. So have a good go. So don't rub it all off because part of what makes it look good is that there's black as well. So give those a really good scrub. So you've got some nice colours coming through. Then what you need to do is you need to get your, your stick and put your your other bit on top of on top of it. So it's quite difficult to get it on. So you might need a grown up to help you. So pop that on like that. And then we're going to take this piece that you've just decorated and we're going to put that hole in the middle is going to go onto our our stick. And then you're going to take each corner one at a time and fold it in one at a time so that it goes over that central pole. So fold them all in until it looks like a windmill. And then you want to get your little, little tubey bit and just pop that on the end until it clicks on. And then that will hold your windmill together. And that makes a lovely firework. And you can spin it with your fingers, you can blow at it, and you also might find if you run along with it that it spins really well. Well, that's made you a lovely firework. Well done.